met my dad's course and this is going to be the first run for me with the new Hyrax tires. Kind of excited about these. I have no idea how they're going to do. But it did, it did give out 34 grams of weight on the nose by switching to them. Missed that weight up front, I know that. I think they have more grip than I can use. This is a grip test. Hopefully it won't tip over backwards. I think they did as well as the Patagonias did. Yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh, Dad, this is killing me. To not have that it, by swapping to these tires by dumping the the front weight that I had nope they won't fit because I had the same weights you have yeah This is going to be a short tire test video today. What I'm finding out is um, on these rims, these tires just don't have enough weight behind them on the nose to take advantage of the amount of grip that they have. It's just, it's got more grip than it has uh, center gravity. And uh, by getting rid of that 34 grams that I told you about in the last video, it's just not going to put these tires to a test. Um, clearly, this thing has a ton of uh, traction. I just can't use it. Today's test went uh, kind of like I thought it would. I just don't think that stock plastic wheels have enough weight to keep the nose pinned down when you get into a high angle um, incline and start putting torque behind it. It just wants to flip the truck over backwards. So uh, with the SSD rims on tomorrow with the brass insert, um, it should be a different story. But um, today just shows you what plastic wheels can do. And uh, it's not much compared to what you can do with uh, metal wheels. So I'll get that taken care of tomorrow afternoon and uh, take it back to my dad's course. And we'll see how it does with some real rims under it.